Hey there guys and girls, it's MegaJ here, and today's video, I'm reviewing Spooky Month, Spooky Month on that British Nephew channel. I'm reviewing that Spooky Month, Spooky Month, the new one, which is called, Udum, Ud, um, Shallow High, hold on, I'll ask Google, go how to pronounce it, let's see. Hollow Sorrows. Hollow Sorrows. So, I'm going to explain the plot, and this is my full review, and this is going to be honest, so if you want to hate on my review, that's fine. So let's start off with the first one. Two burglars break in, in that skid's house, but then an evil spider comes, and a alarm, the burglar alarm comes off, and the other b burglar gets away, but then the mother just beats him up, up and then the mother just looks at the stuff that has just been thrown around and and she gets a call from June June talks about how does she want to go out for a drink and that and yeah it's quite similar of what's going on so she talks for about out a day an hour or so until we see that she says she could go for a drink she's watching the exorcist exorcist and gets her boyfriend or something to there. Now we get Skid, who basically says, are you throwing this away? Are you throwing all of this away? He shows a picture of what we can see, the father. The now if you watch Spooky Month, you know that Skid doesn't only has a mother. And... And for those who want to know what happened to Skid's dad, it implies that one of the crow evil cult, oh, he has mysteriously passed away under some under some things. Now, I'll go to Pump's house and. They basically are trying to get guided the right way around. Then we get the mother of the exterminator, which I absolutely like how they are directing this story. And I think it's really good. Now, I know I'm four months late, but this is a pretty good one. So they're basically trying to get Pump and Skid to know uh, the difference of right and wrong. And in it, you know, we get... Kev, the candy store owner, yeah, and the other guy who we'll just call Dave for short. So Dave basically is this new employee for Kev. Then and they go around, and an officer, 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 drops one of the lines that actually made me cry. I, which was that your parents will be proud, and that's actually really, and. In it, 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 Skid says, my mum wasn't feeling good, and then he said, what about your father, which he doesn't respond, and he said, oh, um, I understand, and that part actually, actually, in my opinion, you know, just shows, I was like, of why? Pinned. and like like the one thing that just made me cry was like when he was saying like oh um, that he was like nervous to talk about his dad it was one of those scenes that has had like put like it impact on like like what should be told now the whole story is just them i'm going around trying to stop and the demon is this like surgeon or whatever named patty so they get rid of that and roy and his friends whatever the ones that a lot of people will hate so they throw holy water and they're trying to ask for forgiveness and the whole thing so then skid and pump become 
devils bulls and they have to stop the demon from like like ever becoming evil in that and stop from ever for going back but yeah the cult then later on kip snaps so that's the priest and joe yeah, was just um one thing then he gets to like the star devil whatever his name is miss and it makes him bow out and then we get to a cut where we see pump i'm um, just being sad and ask for forgiveness then the sister's like yo what's going on one. Then the grandpa gives Skid a, the octopus toy, and it shows that he bought it. And the one thing that actually, actually, in my opinion, just make this all like, like, like sad is that it's like it's showing like. That because he says in like. like how his father works a lot and like like it's one of those things that just and it's just like it just just absolutely makes me sad about how like they delivered like a story in that and like like for the most part you would think that the mothers would work him but no the mother I think got killed by a cult or something like that and like the grandpa takes care of them which this is what makes me so sad it's like they made whole thing about our kids getting delivered to like the right direction in that and that's what actually makes it more like sad it's oh, in trouble. oh sorry right it makes it more sad that it's that it's it's just that sad to like deliver of like what's actually going on and like like the one scene that actually made me cry was like the one scene where skid says oh i want to be a better person and then and his mother like hugs him and that and i actually cried i was actually sad because it's trying to prove to like teenagers and kids that uh, parents do matter because it's trying to say to them Hey, parents actually matter because you're or saying to them that you're trying to be better now. And it's showing like this emotional scene that that I was just crying. I saw this scene and it was just so it was, it was like so sad. and that uh, because like the scene it, like you would expect they would have like 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 a scene where they would just explain like what's gonna happen but no they didn't they just they just throw into some things like oh yeah these are the characters and that and yeah now if you never watched spooky month please watch it because it's one of the best s and yeah so the plot i would give like a nine out of ten it was a really good plot of having a priest trying to guide skid and pump into like this like path where they have to be good and that that and the reason why i give it a nine out of ten is because like 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 i thought it would just have like some new creature in that like with the the um spooky mum four which in my opinion i'm trying to think what else to say is a little bit better but i give it an 8 out of 10 ending because the ending was was that it gets it melted in a microwave than that and yeah the, actually i changed my mind 10 out of 10 the ending's actually good because it's trying to show 
uh, to people who are watching, hey, your parents still matter, and you're still a great person. And yeah, that's what one does, unfortunately. One, uh, I mean, um, I mean, fortunately, this was the best scene because they're trying to prove to, to, or like prove to the audience that it's gonna be fine. And like, like all of the scenes are just really really good in that and yeah the ending's good in that so I'm gonna rate like this jokes like a 10 out of 10 and because they're actually like delivering it really well because I like how they're not being this whole like doing short film and make a lot of money but no they actually did pretty good in my opinion because it's like it's like when you have these like people who Oh, sorry. Who have like got in to like the law? They don't know what's bound to happen. Cause in like part three, we had the unwanted guest. On part two, we had the stars. We had part four, the deadly smiles. Part five, the tender treats. It's part six, which, oh my god, odd. Oh my god, I cannot believe. That at this was the best thing I ever seen in this scene. Oh my god! And the reason why I like this so much is because they actually nailed it. So they actually actually looked from like the parts they did and that, and they actually changed a few things, which I found good. Like I like the uncle in it. It's just um. So, how do I say this without without being con controversial? Sure. So the uncle, I would say, a is the fun. Yes. Yes, and he would say like, because in the first part, he he comes back and then he's like, oh no, it's a stranger. Sure, and it's so funny. I can't stop laughing of it because it's like I I really good bit but there was one where they did like the cannibalism killer or whatever cannibalism killer so there's this like so in part five I think if I'm right I, oh, I'm gonna go check because because I cannot be bothered to edit out my mistake no part five sorry so in part five he's like this so he started out as this like is out as this like person who does this like grill boy in it and then he turns into like a cannibalism serial Killer. And then they would stalk like Jill and Judy, like the skid and pumps, mum. But he's, I think he was recently deceased. I think because he was shot. Oh, uh, and like, like it's one of those things where it's just like, it's like, oh, what is it gonna be next? But yeah, so. On to the last ranking of it. I think I would. I think I'll give it like a eleven out of ten. They did the story really good in that. But anyways, that was Spooky Month. Spooky Month six reviewed. I'm going. I'm gonna see you guys later. See you later. Bye.